my name is Leanna and welcome back to my channel. It's time for Vlogmas! I think I'm crazy for even trying this. Like, what Vlogmas gonna mean for my channel? I'm gonna post, at least try to post a video every day up until Christmas, it means there will be 25 videos. I am crazy for trying this, but we'll see how it goes. Let's hope I'm not going to fail, but that's not guaranteed. So, it's going to be like a mix of vlogs and videos like this where I just sit down and talk. Let's talk about my December plans. I already told you about oh, about videos, how, what they're gonna be. Just, we'll have to wait. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. Because I feel like I'm gonna fail, but I don't want to fail. But let's talk reading plans. There are three readathons happening that I'm participating in. There are so many amazing readathons in December, but I can't participate in them all, or I will go crazy. Even these ones will drive me crazy. The first two are months long, like they are for entire December. The first one is the reindeer readathon and it's created by Breakeven Books and there are four hosts, four, four, not three, four. And each host has a team and I don't remember what else there were, what teams. I know there was Snowflake, Mistletoe, Oh, I don't remember. But I'm team mistletoe. Prompts are named after reindeers. So there are nine prompts and one extra. But you can't double up on those prompts. There are just one prompt for... One book for a prompt. I haven't picked out a book for all of them because... I know I'm not gonna read like nine books. It's just not gonna happen. But I'm gonna show you some I have picked up and then whatever else I pick up you're gonna see in the vlogs and other videos probably. I know I have one behind me. I don't know what prompt I'm gonna be reading it for. But I'm reading... Here it is. I'm gonna read P.S. I Still Love You by Jenny Han. I'm buddy reading it with Hilary from Melted Books. He, she is such an amazing person. I just... Oh, I appreciate her commenting and watching my videos so much. And oh, I just don't know how to thank her. She's so sweet. So, we're buddy reading the second book and Laura Jean Trilogy, how it's called, I don't know. But yeah, we're reading that one. I don't know what prompt that's gonna be for, so yes. The next one. So I'm just gonna read a few prompts. I uh, have picked out the books. So I picked out for Dasher. That is a fast read book under 250 pages. And for that I picked the Night is Darkening Round Me by Emily Bronte. And it's her poetry. It's like this little Penguin Classics, little black book. And it is under 250 pages. It's just 55, I think. Yeah, it's 55 pages long. So, short book. The next one I have chosen for is Dancer, a book that has a main theme of music or dance. And for that I picked A Thousand Perfect Notes by 
CG Drews. I don't know what that book is about, but I know that it has something to do with music. It says on the back, Beck's mother, a once famous pianist, lives out her shattered dreams through her son. So, it has music. And I like the cover that it's like a butterfly. It's a beautiful butterfly. And I think I got this one in an Illumicrate box like two years ago or something. And I still haven't read it. Well, the next is Prancer, a book that has moved around your shelf, but you still haven't read it yet. For that I chose Ruin and Rising by Lee Bardugo, because that's like the third book in Grisha trilogy and I st still haven't read that. I read the first one exactly a year ago in December and the second one I think in August. So I think it's time to try to read the third one. So I'm done with the series and I, I can continue on to Six of Crows because I really want to read that series. But Cupid! A book that has a romance as its main theme. And I have an ebook, A Christmas Wedding. I know, I think it's a romance. It sounds like romance, and I think it was by Page Toon. And it's a quite short book. Rudolph, a book with red on the cover. And for that, I picked this one. It's a Latvian author, Inga Jolude. And it's her story collection, short story collection. And it's called Mirnaims Ademokokam. Oh my god, I just can't think of the title. But if I remember, I'm gonna write it like down here somewhere what it's in English. And there is. A girl with red dress and red flowers on the tree and here the branch so yeah and then the extra thing is a Christmas star read a book over 500 pages so I don't have I have technically a book with over 500 pages oh I don't have a dust jacket on this is 700 something book and I'm on page 176 and this is the girl who kicked the hornet's nest and I would really like to finish it in December like by the year ends but we'll see how it goes if I pick up this one for reindeer readathon then there is Winter Magical Readathon happening, created by G from Book Roast, and she created a website for this Winter Magical Readathon. And you're gonna have to answer questions and follow the path that it leads you. And you're gonna choose a book like when you know what the prompt is on the go. So, and that opens on December 1st today. So if you want to try that read it on, go ahead and try. That's gonna be amazing, I think. I love magical read it on. There is Bookie Trials Winter Quest happening from the 2nd to 9th of December. And for this one you have to read as less books as you can to complete all the prompts and uh, I struggled so much to pick a book but I actually didn't take the book out of the shelf so wait a moment I'm gonna get the book I'm back <clears throat> the bookie trials winter quest you have to read uh, have a body read book with LGBTQIA+ plus characters, light a candle or have a warm drink while reading, Recommend, recommended by a booktuber, read from favorite genre or author you're given five stars to, book by a marginalized author, contains death or themes of death, 
white book or contains snow winter themes read a book you already own or free or as freely available like library script or something like that contains one or more animals or magical beasts contains morally gray characters or villainous main character I'm not gonna like go for all of them because I know that's not gonna happen in a week but I saw that people have picked up Girl of Storm and Shadow was that the name? It's the second book following Girl Girls of Paper and Fire by Natasha Ngan and so I guess this one fits it too. It at least few of the prompts, definitely. I might listen to it on script, but we'll see how it goes. I might like do both at the same time, like listen and read it physically at the same time. I mentioned all three readathons. I've mentioned that I'm doing videos every day that I'm already dreading, but I think that's it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please let me know if you're participating in any readathons, especially if you're participating in the ones I am. So I'm gonna link everything in this description box. Like all the readathon, the creators and their announcement videos gonna be down in the description box below. Thank you for watching and I see you tomorrow. Bye. Uh, why am I doing this? Why have I decided to put have a video up on uh, every day up until Christmas? Why? I can't remember when Vlogmas started. I think it was Ingrid Nilsson back when she was Miss Glamorazzi. I forgot to show you my Christmas jumper. I have a Christmas jumper on. Did you? Oh, maybe you saw <clears throat> when I got up. I have one with a kitty. This is my only Christmas jumper I have. The only one I have I bought last year. So. Kitty one. It's just when I saw that it's a kitty I had to have it. Because crazy cat lady. Where do I put these? I have candles here. So let's put them just there. It's not even 11 a.m. And it's this dark. It's like, I don't know how to film in this weather, or not weather, but time of the year, because it's so dark and I don't get normal natural light, but let's hope I'm gonna survive.